Hi, my beautiful Pisces. This is your November 5th, 2022 reading, Pisces. Let's see what the message is. Go ahead and hit that like button for me, you guys. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. For my new subscribers, old subscribers, third parties and cross watchers, what's up? All right. Let's see what is this message. Thank you guys so much for joining the channel memberships. I appreciate all your love and support to this channel. All right. I see you already know that this reading could be a couple of days in advance, a couple of days behind. Hopefully you hear it when you're intended to hear this message. Hopefully it helps you on your spiritual journey. And let's get into this. Seven of Wands. Ooh, Pisces, Pisces. Seven of Wands is about standing your ground, Pisces, okay? All right. It's an energy of like... I already know what it is that I want. I already can envision this. I see this for myself. It's something that you, you know, feel strongly about. This could also be about manifesting. This could be about visualizations or something that you see for yourself or visualize, something that you hope for. Um, Oh, and maybe it's like, I've already chose my options, or this is the option that I choose. This is the option that I want or desire. So you strongly desire something and you don't want anything else is what I'm hearing. Like, this is what I desire. This is what I'm going after. You're, yeah, you can't be stopped is the energy. No one's going to stop me. This is what it is that I, like, I don't want anything else. This is what I want. So this is like, you're persevering, you're pushing through. All right, you're determined. You're fighting for something. What's coming towards you? You're not letting anybody get in your way. Three of Pentacles. So you guys could be fighting for a position, a job, career. Like this is like determined, determination, fighting for something, not letting anything get in your way. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like you're not going to affect my job, my career. You're not going to affect something that I worked so hard for. You're wanting to see completion in this situation. You want success in this situation. This could also be about climbing the social ladder. This could be about climbing some type of ladder here to your career, your success, your goals. You go Pisces. Okay. I'm proud of you guys. And I feel like you know, this is really good. I feel like whoever's coming towards you are people who really does, they, they see your strength. They see your strength. They see your inner strength. They do see the strength that you have. They see your desire. They see it. They see something in you. They see something in you. This could have to do with some people going back to school, going to get a degree, going for your career. Like, you know, I'm going after this. I can't be stopped. I can't be stopped. I won't let anything stop me. I don't want anything else. This is what I want. This is what I chose. I'm going after it. Um, that's all it looks like, baby. And it's like, you can't be stopped. You're determined. You're persevering. And I feel like people see it. People see it. Maybe like an instructor or um, a boss at the job or a, su a supervisor or someone of superior that's superior to you. They see all of your hard work. They see that you are actually putting in a lot of effort and a lot of work and they are willing and ready to work with you. They are willing and ready to work with you. How should Pisces be coming towards the situation? Because it's not bad. Someone is definitely, someone. whoever's coming towards you, they're going to work with you. They're going to work with you. Um, so maybe that's the issue that you're, you're doing all of this and you may feel like someone's not going to work with you. They, they're working with you or they're going to try to work with you. This is like giving you extra credit for somebody. I don't know. This may be like somebody in college or like helping you, assisting you, um, giving you extra points, extra feedback. Um some type of praise or recognition, uh, or maybe assisting you on how to do the job a lot better than what you are. Or I'm also even trying, oh, they're trying to make something easy for you. Wow. I just heard that they're trying to make it easy for you because they see so, they see something in you. Someone sees a lot, they see something in you. They see how driven you are. They see how motivated you are. So they're going to be trying to help and assist you and make something easy for you because the strength card is here. Oh my goodness. I didn't even pick up that. The nine of swords and strength. Okay, so I didn't see the nine of swords. So yeah, they're trying to make something easy for you. All right, let's see. How should prices be coming towards the situation, this person? Ooh, two of swords. 
Two of Swords came out here. Okay, so Pisces, why do I feel like... Ooh, you may not be... Um, oh, wow. You're... um. This is you not make... Okay, you're not... You're not sure. You have the blindfolds on. You're being a stalemate. You're not sure how you should answer or communicate or what you should say back to this person. Um, you may feel like, hmm. yeah, it's some, see, you're not, you're not in a receiving position. Maybe you're not sure if you should receive something from this person. You're not sure if you should let someone help you. You're not sure if you should, um, because someone's about to offer you extra credit or some type of help, or they're going to try to make your life easy or make something easy for you. And you're not sure whatever it is that they have, um, communicated with you you're not sure if you should say yes to it you're not sure if you should you're indecisive about this and so you're being a stalemate you're indecisive and it's almost like you're pushing away this help okay now i'm hearing the romance angel cards okay uh yeah this is like helpful people something about helpful people someone's trying to help you i just got a little ding just now someone's trying to help you this is about helpful people how should pisces come towards a situation yeah you feel burdened by this so... Oh my God, two of swords came out again. Y'all know I can't make this up. So yeah, you're being a stalemate. You're not sure what decision to make. How should Pisces be coming towards the situation? Okay, three of wands. Really? Okay. So, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So you're waiting. You may have been like, yeah, you feel burdened. You have been feeling burdened because you've done, you've worked, like you have been pushing so hard. You have been so determined and you have been so dedicated, so driven and fighting for something here. Um, for some type of success in your future to see something happen. And there's some type of assistance. I'm seeing helpful people. You're going to get some type of assistance here. But I do feel like it may be right now on like, you, it's almost like you're not getting an answer right now. That's what happened. That's what's going on. You're not getting some type of an answer. And um, I'm seeing this energy where you're like, oh, that's what it is. Okay. The, you're coming out as a stalemate. But it's because... It's like waiting for something here. So you've done all that you could do. And now you just have to wait because someone in your energy, they're waiting. So someone's just, okay, so it's okay, Pisces. Is, uh, everything is good. Oh my gosh. It's fine. It's fine. It's all right. It's great. Um, you will hear back from this situation, this person. This will be advancing to the next level for you or something will be moving forward um, in your favor. I feel like something is going to help you because you're burdened. You have a lot on your plate. You have a lot on you. You've been doing so much. I feel like you're, there's a burden energy from you. And I feel like it, you're going to have to let someone, it's okay to let someone help you is what spirit is saying. It's okay to let someone help you this time. It's fine. You know, let someone help you. I'm also hearing it's okay to ask for help because the two of swords is you being a stalemate. So some of you guys may not be asking for help. And I feel like help is out there because the three of wands is like, hey, help is out there. Some of you guys are needing, really needing to, I, I know you've been trying to do this yourself. I know you've been trying to push through and persevere yourself. I know you've been giving it all you got. I understand. I've, I was like that where I didn't want to ask for help and kind of still don't. I'm someone who does not like to ask for help. I, you know, I'm like, oh, I got it. I got it myself. I'm going to do it because no one else is going to do it the way that I do it, blah, blah, blah. But I'm hearing it's okay to ask for help. So, you know, you guys are being a stalemate and not asking for help. You're not. Uh, but help is on the way. Hey, help is on the way. So help is on the way. You're going to be getting some type of help. Someone's going to be making your life a little bit easier. And I do see that. And it's coming with the three of wands. It's like something that's, you know, they're something like they may be waiting for something, waiting for some type of approval, waiting to hear back from someone. They have they have things that they have to do on their end, too. Um, so, and they can't force it. Yeah, they can't force it with the strength part. They can't make people jump and move when they want, but help is on the way and it is coming. 
And <laughs> I can see you may even feel burdened by that because maybe you're you're through that process. Maybe you finally did ask for help and these people are helping you and you need to know that. And maybe you're being a little pushy now because maybe you move forward and you're being pushy about the situation, but you need to know that um, there's going to have to be, there's some type of line of communication or some type of uh, communication that's having to happen here behind the scenes or with other people in order for you to get something that you deserve, okay? Or something that... Uh, Someone is wanting to help you with and assist you with. So right now, Spirit is just saying you need to kind of wait, wait for your ships to come in. And also, if you've been like trying to reach out and call someone and do things, I'm hearing that you don't have to do that. I don't know why Spirit is saying wait. Like you don't have to call. You don't have to pick up the phone. You don't have to keep asking someone. So you've gotten to the point where you didn't want to ask for help. Now you're getting help. And so now it's like, you're like, okay, are y'all going to help me? 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 And it's like, no, Spirit is saying, just chill. You don't have to do any of that. You don't have to reach out. You don't have to talk. Just sit back. Um, you know, you don't have to pick up the phone. It, now is the time to wait right now. It's just, you, you're just in a waiting period where you have to wait, but help and assistance here is on the way. So that's what I'm hearing, Pisces, because that's what's going on. You want to push the issue now because you're not someone who likes to wait. Like you may be impatient. You're not someone who let people help you. So if you don't let people help you, then when you do get help, you're like, hey, are you going to do it now? Are you going to do it now? Are you going to do it now? Now, 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 now. So Sam is like, no, stop, stop, stop. You're good. You're good. Just wait. Just wait. Your ships are coming in. 